good. Morning, everybody. It's Wednesday. Happy Wednesday to you. It is 22nd of December. Feeling... I don't know. I don't know. It's a weird day today. I really don't have anything to be getting up to at work. Well, I do. I have things, like I've been saying, I've, I've got things that I've uh, got to be getting up to, but um, I don't know how much more I can drag it out for. There are lots of bits and bobs to be doing, and I'm getting on with them, but like, yeah. It's a, it's a weird situation. Sorry, I can't, I can't adjust this camera to where I want it to be. <laughs> this is probably going to be my quietest day this week. I have plans for tomorrow and then Friday. As far as my schedule is concerned, I have meetings, but I'm pretty sure they're going to be cancelled because it's Christmas Eve and no one wants to be in a meeting on Christmas Eve. I think that um, Friday is also going to be a very quiet day. But yeah, today in particular, I'm kind of just like a bit aimless and not really sure what to do with myself, which is fine. Um, I can I can figure stuff out for myself to be getting up to. It's just a case of figuring out how to make it last a long time, I suppose. Um, sorry, just emails. This is the stuff that I'm getting up to. Thing is, is I just, I'm too productive. <laughs> if I try and get something done, I'll get it done efficiently. No matter how hard I try not to, I just do, yeah. Feeling a bit sleepy, I did sleep much better last night, I didn't wake up at 3.30. I think I went to sleep relatively late though, probably closer to 11, but slept soundly. <laughs> so yeah, it's going to be a really quiet day at work, and then after work today, um, I'm going to go get my booster vaccine. I kind of, I've been waiting to get a text from my doctor to go book an appointment like I did with my um, actual vaccine because um, initially that's how they were doing it. They were doing it the same way the initial vaccines were rolled out, which is elderly and vulnerable first and then gradually going down in age. Um, and so as a 23 year old who's moderately healthy, as far as COVID is concerned at least, I'm at the very bottom of the list. Uh, and so I was just waiting for my text, but obviously over the past couple of weeks, um, COVID has kind of made made a big re-emergence, um, not that it ever really disappeared, it's just a new variant has appeared and you know it's suddenly at the forefront of everything again. So now it's it's a bit more like a free-for-all and I, I kind of just forgot that that was the case and uh, I'm just, I'm basically just going to do a walk-in. Uh, every day I've been checking my town's like Facebook page and they've been saying that the walk-in centre is basically empty and that you know it's it's like a 15 to 25 minute process of showing up, showing them your vaccine card, going in, getting the booster and then walking out again. So I figure I might as well get that done, get that sorted, get my booster in place. Um, very important to do what we can given the situation. So that's what I'm up to after work this evening. I'm going to go straight from work to the walk-in centre and get my, my booster, my third COVID vaccine. And then hopefully if I get any side effects, they should be gone by Christmas Day. One can hope, but yeah. For the rest of today, slow day at work. And then that's my evening. And then I'll try and be somewhat productive with my evening. Either, I don't know if I've got the energy to wrap presents, I'm not gonna lie. After my vaccine, I don't think I'll have the energy to wrap presents. I might save that for tomorrow. I know, I know, very last minute but that's just Christmas this year for me. I might do some stuff to do with the channel rebrand going into going into the new year that I was meant to get sorted last night but didn't get a chance to. Right, advert calendars. It was the 22nd. Sounds a Christmas pudding. Very nice. Let's go get my chocolate. <laughs> you can't summon the camera and then hide away. That's not how this works. Strawberry cream. It's my favourite quality street. Yeah. I'm going to continue with my work day now. 
so I'll catch up with you probably when I'm about to leave to go get my, my booster. Oh hey, that's right everyone, I'm wearing clothes for the first time. <laughs> How exciting. I just finished work and I've just been getting myself ready to get out to go get my booster vaccine. I've been trying to find um, any kind of information about it today because like I was saying this morning for the past couple of weeks on my, on my well the past week on my Facebook, um, my town's Facebook page, I've been seeing people say oh it's it's not busy, it's, it's like 20 15 to 25 minutes to go in and get your vaccine um, if you're just a walk-in and you don't have an appointment because I don't have an appointment so I'm gonna test that theory by just showing up and hoping that they can see me but um, I was just trying to find some kind of reassurance online that that was in fact the case I can't find any and I can't find any of the original posts saying oh actually it's not busy so that's not good but um, I'm sure it will be fine but yeah I put my Emma cream on um, I didn't really, I just didn't know what to wear because it's freezing today. It was frosty this morning, which we love to see on the week of Christmas. I was like, I can't put on a jumper because I won't be able to roll up my sleeve for them to give me a vaccine. And otherwise I would have to like take my jumper off in order to get the vaccine and then I'll just be cold. <laughs> so I've gone for one of these so that I can just do that. There's my Emla cream. And I'll pull it back on again. Hopefully. Hopefully I'll be warm enough. But yeah, that's the, that's the sitch. Now I'm just going to try and find a little bit of reassurance that I can just do a walk in and then I'm just going. I can't find anything, I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go. My poor dad is inconveniencing himself, giving me a lift. So hopefully they'll see me. Otherwise I've just wasted his time. I need to put some hand cream on when I get back. Oh, you can see it. I need to put the hand cream on when I get back. I've been washing my hands and hand sanitizing quite a lot, given the fact that it's the week of Christmas and COVID is now rampant again. So my hands are now really dry. Let me get my hand cream out actually to remind me later. Where is my hand cream? What drawer did I put it in? It smells really good in my drawers. My candles are in my bottom drawer on my bedside table. So whenever I open a drawer from here, it just smells so good. Is that it? Yeah. This one from Lush. I don't remember where I got it because I don't think I bought it for myself. It's dream cream. It smells good. I didn't buy it for myself. I don't know who bought it for me, but it's it's good. I'm gonna leave that there for myself for when I come back. Okay, let's go get this booster. Wish me luck. I'm going to come to visit me. She's been really weird today. We had a little cuddle while I was working. She did the thing where she sat in front of me while I was on my laptop. Realised I wasn't paying her much attention and then sat in my sister's room all day next to the her radiator. And she's only just come back in. Huh? Yeah, you're very sleepy, aren't you? She's so cute. Good evening, everyone. I'm back. I came back from my vaccine. I realised that now I didn't catch up when I came back. I, I was very cold. I immediately came back in and put my pyjamas back on because it was freezing. I did have my coat with me as well so while I was actually there I was fine but walking from the vaccination centre to the car and then to the car to my house it's cold. It's very cold today. <laughs> it was very chilly but I've officially had my booster. I am uh, three dosed now, which is awesome. Very, very quick this time around. The nurse was very like, like done. She was just like, right, let's get this over with. It was, it was very, very quick. Like normally the nurse will sit down and have a chat. There's like a list of questions they have to ask. She didn't even ask them. She was like, read the sheet and tell me if, if the answer is yes to any of them. It was like, they'll, have you been sick in the past? however many days have you developed a cough etc etc to which the answer is always no so she was just like yeah just read that if the answer is yes let me know and then she was like oh is this your name and I was like yeah was like cool clicked on the computer and then I was like cool this is what we're gonna do and then she started loading the needle I didn't even get the chance to explain to her that I had Emla cream on um I don't think she even saw me take the cling film off my arm she just she she just went for it and I was like oh okay cool and then it was over and she was like okay have a good christmas and i was like oh, thanks you too bye 
<laughs> it was it was just so fast in compared every other nurse that I've had has had at least a little bit of a conversation with me and this nurse was just like no we don't do conversations here I mean to be fair can I I don't blame her let's be real it's a pandemic and you know it's been like a year and a half two years almost and she's still dealing with this crap. At least she's dealing with responsible people who are coming in to get protected and not, you know, people who are refusing vaccines and being in inconvenienced to the entire planet at the moment. I just love this little girl so much, she's so cute. Anyway, I've just been called down for dinner, so I'm gonna go have some dinner now. Yeah, it's been a good day. It was a very, very quiet day at work managed to keep myself occupied just about but yeah it was very very quiet um no complaints i have a busier day tomorrow but not like busy it's gonna be nice and slow paced and yeah just what you need in the week uh leading up to christmas yeah then i got my booster which is always a good thing and then i spent most of this evening being productive doing things towards my youtube channel getting chris's opinion on some things i've been working on um the channel rebrand going into the new year which is exciting so yeah it's been a good day and i'm gonna end the vlog here so that i can go grab my dinner and edit you thanks very much for watching everyone we'll see you guys tomorrow say bye bye